Mercy now. Have fun with this. I'm on the roll. Let's go. In for the kill. Nothing 
one to regret this. In for the kill! <sighs> Right. Try this on your side. Well, aren't you a stubborn thing? <laughs> Spick and span. Now we're talking. Have fun with this. I'll take it. Now then. I'd say that's enough for a warm up. Let's have some fun! What? <clears throat> gotta stop the bleeding. This is no way to fight. You're gonna get... I'm on a roll! Here we go! No begging for mercy now. Come on. All good. I won't hold back. Ready for the knockout? You're going to regret this. Check this out. <sighs> well, aren't you a stubborn thing? <laughs> Spick and spank. You want some? Now we're talking. Hmm. Watch this. Hope this hurts. <laughs> Follow my lead. Here's to a happy family reunion. I'm on a roll. Let's go. Let's see. Let's do it. Try to block this. Is this what you like? Here we go. Try this on the side. What's the whole No thing? begging for mercy now. Have fun with this. I won't hold back. <laughs> right. What a chip this out. Maximum pressure. <laughs> now we're talking. <laughs> Learning more every day. <laughs> Doing better than I thought. Yes! <laughs> Moving up in the world. Hell yeah! We should relish this moment.
Sweet! Strong! Be straight with me. What are you all so afraid of? Are you scared of screwing up people's lives? <clears throat> or maybe... Maybe you just don't want to fail again. Whatever the reason... You'll never know if you don't try. You act like it's so simple. Say we do try. What happens if it all goes to hell again, huh? If that day comes... You keep on pushing through. As long as you're breathing, keep moving, keep trying, and figure it out. There you go again. Always the hero. Say what you want. It's the only way I know. Besides, this is the last time. Anyway, I'm gone. You won't be hearing from me again. Wait. Don't go. Kiryu-san, I get that you don't have a lot of time left. Still, it's not worth it. That's no reason for you to run off and get yourself killed. You're wrong, Daigo. What? Honestly, it's a weight off my shoulders. My death's finally worth a damn. Kiryu, what are you saying? I'm the same as you guys. I've screwed up more lives than I can count at this point. Not to mention, I'm a Yakuza. I haven't exactly lived a life that I can be proud of. Yet even then, through it all, I'm somehow still here. So that's it. The Yakuza have made a huge mess for themselves. Once I grab hold, I am taking it with me. You're talking out of your ass, Kiryu! That's no excuse to... Wait till things settle down. Come then, Kasuga's gonna need your help. The Yakuza have one chance. Their future depends on him. Don't you leave! Don't you dare leave! Shiryu-chan! You know, it's funny. I came to ask you guys for help. But maybe, all I wanted was one last fight. <sighs> Wait, curious on. No Daigo Dojima, Taiga Saijima, or Goro Majima. Ah, oh, man. If they just get off their asses, we'd have wrapped things up by now. <laughs> You're probably right. <sighs> they seem to have made up their minds, though. It's not like we can force them to help out. Got me there. I swear. To think the Tatara Channel got a hold of them, too. Yeah. Hey! Oh, whoa! Isn't that Kiryu? Yeah, look! It's gotta be him! It really is! What's going on? <clears throat> if we let this guy roam free, the Yakuza will just keep coming back! I don't care if I get locked up! He's never gonna hurt us again! You don't have time to take these guys on. Let's lose them and get back to Kasuga's place. <sighs> get back here, dammit! <sighs>
shape. Oh, hey, cute dog. <laughs> I'd love to get one of my own someday. I always wanted one of those big ones you could pal around with. I've looked after a dog before. It was nice. I remember how he'd always beg to go on walks, even been in storms. That's the pet owner experience. <laughs> oh, makes me want one too. I went to the pet store the other day, actually. Saw this big hamster thing. It was so cute. I almost adopted it. Big hamster thing? Yeah, what, what was it called again? Chin something? Chinchilla? That's right, chinchilla. Oh, it had such cute little eyes. I'd like a guinea pig, I think. What about you, Nanchan? When I was homeless, there were crows and cats everywhere. Hard to think of them as pets after that, to be honest. Spent too much time wanting to kick their ass for snatching my food. Oh, that's sad. When I get a big dog, Nambukun, I'll let you fight him. No, you will not. <laughs> I kick that dog's ass. Irashaimase. Let's dig in. Bon appetit. Thanks for buying. Oh, that great. is food. food. Arigatou gozaimashita.
ありがとうございますいらっしゃいませありがとうございました調子に乗るなよ。This came from. I'm good. Good one. <laughs> You're quite <laughs> You're the radiance. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I'm ready. Learning more every day. Yes. Moving up in the world.
Bring it on. Up yet. Whew. We should relish this moment. Sweet. How are you meant to choose? How's this? Maybe it's time I change styles. First impressions are key. Eh, whatever works. Uh, I don't know about this. Now, what about this with those shoes? Functional. I'm not leaving until it's perfect. Hard to improve on perfection. Getting smarter every day. Strong! How curious! <laughs> Just find something presentable. <laughs> this isn't bad. I don't know about this. Well, let's get started. Doing better than I thought. 
Hell yeah! <sighs> There's more where this came from. Okay... I actually slept well last night. Tatara Channel coming at ya! As always, we're out to boldly reveal the evils the media is just too scared to touch. Let's jump into today's topic. Now look here, everyone knows this face, right? That's right! Photographed in Hawaii just the other day, it's Kazuma Kiryu! But this latest video comes to us from right here in Japan, in our own backyard! That means Kazuma Kiryu's come home. And why, you ask? Well, feast your eyes. This is the head of one of the biggest Yakuza groups of all time, the Tojo Clan's sixth chairman, Daigo Dojima. And that's not all. With him are Tojo Clan officers Goro Majima and Taiga Saijima. These are all major players, Yakuza all-stars, if you will. How about our longtime viewers? I'm sure they recognize these guys, right? Yep, these are the guys who ran that security company from Sotenbori, the same one yours truly covered a while back. A wicked security firm run by former Yakuza members, the company was dissolved shortly after we featured them on our channel. At first, we thought they had well disappeared, but it seems they've simply been hiding out. Now, what's this mean for Kazuma Kiryu? Why would he visit them now of all times? To find out, we've invited the man who risked his very life to bring us this footage. Ah, uh, yes. Hello there. Now, right away, if you don't mind telling us, sir, just how did you end up with this video? Well, I'm a truck driver, you see, and... Yesterday, I picked up this hitchhiker. I didn't know the guy was Kazuma Kiryu at the time. That said, I, I do have an eye for seeing through people. I figured he was way too fishy, so after I dropped him off, I decided to follow him. And that's when you filmed this, after you chased him down, right? So, what were Kazuma Kiryu and his Tojo clan cohorts discussing in their little shack? Did you hear what they said? From what I could hear, at least, it was stuff like going back to the Yakuza and reviving the Tojo clan. Going back to the Yakuza? Did you hear that, folks? And coming from Kazuma Kiryu and the like, does this mean everything we feared is coming true? The Yakuza really are planning their return! What does that spell for the rest of us? When did this video go up? Earlier this morning. It immediately went to number one in trending, and it's even being reported on TV. And that wasn't Chitose, was it? Nope. From what Kasuga told me, Chichan completely cut ties with Eiji after all that happened. My guess is he found a substitute. Actually, some of the more passionate fans have noticed, but only a small percentage. The channel's grown, and now even the numbers alone are drawing in more viewers. Right. And to the majority of them, it doesn't matter if they're getting the truth or not. Dwight said something similar a while back. People will always choose the flashier lie over the duller truth. Of course. There's just one thing we need to figure out then. And that's how to take the second great dissolution out of Ebina's hands. We need Daigo and the others' help. And that won't come easy. 
Hey, hold on a second. Check the video. There's more to it. They see something kind of odd right here. Hmm. Well now, if that's not a shock, I don't know what is. As always, folks, I'll be sure to keep you posted as soon as I hear more. On that note, our next video is a special treat. That's right! Tonight, I'm going live! We had some guests recently. Ebina-san and Sawashiro-san from the Seiryu clan. Remember them? Well, as it turns out, they just offered to make an important announcement right here on my channel! I'll be visiting the Seiryu clan offices in Tokyo up close and personal, so don't miss out! Ebina and Sawashiro. And it's tonight. We don't have much time. Plus, if it's a live stream, that means they'll actually be there. Not only that, but Eiji should be there too. The Seiryu clan's Tokyo office. That's the old Tojo clan headquarters. We'd better head over there. Light as a feather. Oi, Teme! Dada! I'm Jamaska! Learning more every day. Moving up in the world. Whew. We should relish this moment. Cut some teeth. TV last Sunday morning. There was a new Sentai show on. Kind of drew me in, to be honest. I watched it till the end. Oh, I totally get it. The stories are elaborate, the actors are... Young and hot. <laughs> My co-workers watch it too. 
You know how people would always say the enemy should attack while they're transforming? Ugh, yeah. Hey, you're not supposed to care about that. Just suspend your disbelief. Yeah, that's true. But I figure you're in a fight and the guy starts flashing and changing shape. <laughs> I'd be scared shitless. Wouldn't want to get near him either. Guy starts tweaking out in a real fight, that's when you back away. You know, that's a pretty good point. For something so ridiculous, it's an awfully logical argument. Well, let me get started. It's over. Yes. I haven't even warmed up yet. <laughs> Doing better than I thought. Hell yeah. There's more where this came from. <sighs> Maybe there's a good sleep medication around here. Uh, before you chance it with the meds, you ought to rethink your bedtime routines. And you probably toy around with your phone, right? Yeah, that's true. I usually end up watching videos and stuff. Maybe just stop looking at your phone in bed. Yeah, the light from the screen causes your brain to... If you get sleepy and lose your grip, you'll drop your phone on your face. You'll just wake yourself up, and who wants that? Well, I, I was talking more about the science and what have you, but... Oh, uh, well, I guess the result's the same. Light as a feather. Well, let me get started. Yes. I haven't even Ooh. warmed up yet. Okay. 
Fight one. Ready, go! Fight two! Ready, go! Fight one. Ready, go! Ready, go! Fight two, ready, go! Fight one, ready, go! Ready, go!
Fight 3! Ready, go! Fight four. Ready, go. Excellent. Better run home to Mama now. Fight one. Ready, go. Fight two, ready, go! Fight three! Ready, go! Over. Remember, stretching is important. That takes me back. We gonna fight some more? Think I'll enjoy this. Yeah. <laughs>
Learning more every day. Moving up in the world. <sighs> There's more where this came from.